Yo, what it is, man? Thug Alarm Marco, K777, sending love, that Empire TV to everyone who's watching this video. And today's video topic is gang stalking. So, with that being said, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share the video. I got more content coming in 2021. Without further ado, let's dive into it. Now, I made a video in the past about gang stalking. Alright? So, in this video, I'm going to be going over why this happens and how to counter and combat gang stalking okay so what is gang stalking gang stalking is when a collective group of people watch and stalk an individual person okay individuals can be doing this for numerous amounts of reasons okay it could be because you have uh political or religious differences um, you're seeking and speaking the truth. Um, you're operating at a higher level of energy or frequency. Uh, it could be a various amount of reasons this is happening. Okay, so understand these demons know who you are. Okay, they know who you are as a spirit or soul. Okay, and they know that certain individuals is here right now for this final blat. My bad for this final battle on the planet, which will be taking place in a couple of years or so. Okay, so they know who you are. That's one of the main reasons they usually do this to people. And they do not do this to everybody. They do this to the most powerful spiritual beings, okay? They do this to the ones that are a threat to the new world order, okay? I have been gang stalked plenty of times. To this day, I get gang stalked, okay? So that is what gang stalking is, okay? It's basically demons manifesting inside of people, right? And it's supposed to make you feel uncomfortable or steal your energy, okay? It's supposed to cause confusion or anxiety in your spirit. That's what gang stalking really is. And um, overall, it's to make you have a mental breakdown because after a certain period of time, um, when you continuously see this shit over and over and over, uh, it can actually damage you mentally. You feel me? Because it's a mental thing because you got to understand the demons would rather attack you spiritually than physically because everything is vibration or frequency. So if your frequency high, them fucking with you is like, it ain't even worth it, bro. They, nine times out of ten, you're going to probably kill them. You feel what I'm saying? Everything is frequency and vibration. All right. Especially if you know how to fight like me, you're going to hurt someone. You get what I'm saying? So they're going to attack you spiritually, mentally and um physically but the physical part about it is they're going to attack you based on what you are putting inside your vessel okay that's how the enemy operates you have to put that inside of your vessel okay because your vessel is a portal for your spirit so understand so how do we counter or deal with gang stalking now gang stalking can come in various different shapes sizes forms okay Gang stalking can happen to you at any time. It can happen on the internet, etc. That's another video. So, basically, you deal with gang stalking by understanding what it is at first. You have to understand what is currently taking place. And the only way you're going to be able to see this is if your third eye is opening. Because once your third eye is open, um, your awareness uh, expands. Okay? So, you're hearing your senses your eyesight will increase you will have the ability to see through the veil of the illusions okay so now um one of the ways you counter gang stalking is you can eternalize so what does that mean meditate okay because it's a mental thing you feel me it's an attack on your mind that's what gang stalking really it really is so it's a mental thing so how do you strengthen my bad let me set it over how do you strengthen your mind or your mental spaceship um you have to meditate meditation is one of the most powerful beneficial things you can do for yourself okay especially if you are a spiritual being so understand meditating often is going to help strengthen your mind It's going to help you gain a clear sense of 
focus okay you're gonna be more aware you're gonna be more present not only that you're gonna be more calm okay so that is one of the ways that you counter gang stalking okay meditation not to mention um, everything is inside of you before it is outside of you you have a mini universe inside of your spirit so meditation one of the most powerful things you can do to counter gang stalking okay it starts with the mind they attack you on a mental level okay so meditating often and focusing on yourself clearing your mind of all negativity just putting your mind in a stable calm efficient operated mindset is what's gonna help you okay number two um understand gang stalking is it's designed to steal your energy it's designed to make you feel uncomfortable um you could be walking and somebody behind you would follow you and in your mind you like is this nigga following me following me intuitively you know that he's following you right but um it's designed to make you fearful or to take your energy, but truth be told, these gang stalkers don't have really much power, okay? They don't have that much power like that. You feel what I'm saying? They only are powerful in groups, you feel me? This is why it's a collective or group effort, okay? Because they know that you are chosen. They know that you are operating on a high-ass frequency. They know that you are an angel. So it's gonna take legions of people to take down one motherfucker and i'm not even gonna say take down to try to take down one motherfucker you get what i'm saying because it's all spiritual all right it can be physical but for the most part it's gonna be spiritual and psychological okay that's how they do the angels because they know we strong and powerful as fuck so understand it's just designed to make you feel uncomfortable and uh yeah so number three you have to Operate in your higher self. All right, so what does that mean? Um, you cannot be scared at this point, bro Me and you we are too Awoke and knowledgeable to be afraid of anything at this point I'm talking about we don't even need to be scared of death if you still scared of death. That's a problem G at this point You do not even need to be scared of death my nigga understand You have to be operating in your divine self you have to be walking in your divinity okay so that means everywhere you go you are your spirit you are not governed by this ego no more you know that you are the light okay you have to come to an understanding that these motherfuckers are actually afraid of you okay more than you think they are beyond afraid of you and it's on a spiritual level okay fuck this this ain't even you the the motherfucker that's in the unseen the real you that's who they worried about because everything happens up there then it must happen down here. So they aren't afraid of this flesh because they know this is not you. On a spiritual level, the demons that see your spirit up there, that's who they worried about. So in this physical, this is why you will see certain individuals be so intimidated and nervous when they get around you. Because on a spiritual level, my spirit is literally warning them like, listen, this shit real. The light that's in the spiritual realm that my spirit has is scaring the demons and everything happens in this everything happens in the spiritual then it must manifest in the physical so in the physical this is why a lot of you guys who are chosen high vibrational beings you know your aura your energy is it scares people but understand your spirit is what's scaring these demons i hope you know that your light body that's in the astral the real you the motherfucker that guides you every single day that's who they scared of that's they know that's you up there the real you so understand you gotta be you gotta be operating your higher self okay that's how you deal and beat gang stalking you gotta look at these gang stalkers like what like what up you feel me you cannot be scared of no damn gang stalkers it's go it's a continuous thing it's always going to happen okay but the goal is to steal your energy so you gotta remember um, operating in your higher self not being affected by whatever they are trying to do that because that's the goal is to make you uncomfortable steal your energy maybe maybe try to harm you you feel me because sometimes these demons don't be giving a fuck you feel me they demons sometimes they just risk their life and you might end up hurting them you feel me sometimes they'll do that so don't think that it won't ever get physical but you'll be ready for it you know what i'm saying so you got to be operating operating in your higher self when you're dealing with these gang stalkers man it's the only way if you are operating in your flesh Bro, it's gonna make it easier for them to fuck with you because 
they aren't operating in their flesh. There's a spirit controlling that motherfucking vessel. So you cannot be operating in this no more. You need to be operating in that beast that's inside of you, okay? So anyways, that was the video. Y'all stay tuned for more content. Anyways, I love y'all. Throw a little mark on my gang.